You know, they're gonna be like, Dad, what's going on? And we'll be like, Oh, I don't wanna pay the bill. <laughs> Yeah, so we we not doing stuff that we don't want to do. Let's keep going. <laughs> yeah, what else? <laughs> so we gonna be Welcome living to- in darkness. <laughs> we're friends that laugh. We're friends that shout. Sometimes we don't know what we're talking about, but that won't stop us. Nothing can stop us. Oh, are they? What? I mean, that's the AC. Is it a yeah? They collab? Well, no, they just kind of stole the idea. I would sue. If okay, I so Louisville Comedy Club, <laughs> April twentieth wow. through the twenty second, and then the Comedy Mothership. <laughs> I'm gonna be at the Mothership in Austin. Oh, cool. Twenty eighth through the thirtieth. Uh, Is that like a yeah. headlining thing that you're doing there? Yeah. Or what? Oh, I'm cool. Doing five shows. Yeah. So and it's on the weekend. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. What room? Like they have like different rooms, right? I have no idea. They have like oh, a cool. main room. And a that's pretty room. cool, man. Like the store. No, I know, but I. But they don't they have so they have two two rooms. Okay, yeah. he's in the main room. Got yeah. it. That's awesome. And then I'm probably gonna do Kill Tony that Monday also, but whatever. Before right. it or after it? After, after. he does it on Mondays. Yeah. Right, right. So Mondays is tough. Yeah, it's fine. Well, it's I fine. have to get an early flight to get yeah. here for this. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. So that's gonna be a nightmare, but it is what it is. Oh, Chris, God. your your tickets just went on sale, right? Yeah, Chris, <laughs> go ahead. Yeah, yeah. Okay, because I wanna. Okay. Okay, let me get them up here. Because <laughs> okay, there are a few cities. Just, just let's, uh, ChrisLeah.com, you know, I know you hate when I say that my website, but. Just go there. Yeah, uh, where? Up there? Yeah, go to ChrisLeah.com. Yeah. So, hey, and how then, was you guys this weekend? True. No, <laughs> yeah. But yeah, well, Hamilton, Ontario is probably sold out at this point, but uh, we have uh, a lot of different ones here going up. I don't know. It's not coming up here. Charlotte, North Carolina, Knoxville. Uh, Little Rock I'm going to be in. Have you ever played Little Rock? Uh-uh. No. I don't know if I ever have. Yeah, I don't think I have. Nashville, Calgary, Edmonton, Ottawa, Montreal. Oh, you oh whole Canada. Whole Canada Shit. Yep. Hamilton. Hamilton, Cleveland, Detroit, Orlando, Fort Myers. Yeah. And then I have more coming up soon. So Walt Disney complain. Theater. Yeah. 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 It's a, uh, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, it, uh, it's awesome. I'm, I'm excited. So. Well, I'll be at Magic City in Atlanta <laughs> Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Magic City Strip Club, but really, I'm there for comedy punchline Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Atlanta, come get you some. Oh, uh, you know, I hear they. Ha- I've never been to a strip club in Atlanta, and they are. It's like the craziest shit ever, right? Magic City's like right. the pro ball for strip clubs. Wow, it's the all star game, and the food's ridiculous. Dude, I was just talking about this with, this with someone. So you've you've eaten at a strip club before. Matt, so I've heard all the good things about Magic City. That Lou Williams, the basketball player, okay. when they're in the bubble, remember they weren't allowed to leave? Mm-hmm. The wings are so good. He left the bubble, got busted to buy those wings and go back to the hotel. Yeah. And was suspended. He went for wings. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, that's, right that's the story. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, now, I, now, I posted that and was like, these wings got to be good if Lou Williams is yeah. going to take a six-game suspension. Yeah. He had a comment. Man, this is that shit I don't need pushing this narrative. I was like, whoa, <laughs> hey, be cool, man. You only got suspended. So anyway, I didn't go. To the to the strip club, I postmates the wings that he got, uh, ordered. Okay, now just now that's great. One hundred twenty dollars. Like, check this out. You're a postmate driver. You know what I mean? And you're going to go pick up. I mean, that's awesome, right? That's now you funny. can just like if you have a girlfriend yeah, yeah, or yeah. wife, they're going to be like, "Were you at the strip club?" It's like I was picking up wings. Just do order food. <laughs> they were the best wings I've ever had. Okay, so so hold on. Let me. Let me I, what I don't understand is he got a suspension for going to a strip club because during no, COVID the bubble from leaving oh, from leaving the, the, the COVID bubble thing. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. Which right. is, none of that made sense because you're allowed to like have like your side pieces in the bubble and then they could come and go. But if you left, you well, got suspended. What are they going to say? Hey, no side pieces. They make an <laughs> you announcement. Believe that. <laughs> It was a whole they, they can't say no side pieces. You know, I did a thing for the Rams a few years back. Sean McVay just started become, becoming the coach. And so, like, I was at their practice facility. And then so I was in a cart, and I'm driving around with certain players, and we're just having an a, a interview, you know. And then they, he was like – every single one was like, yeah, with a family bunker – not bunker, but, like, the, the where the family sit is the, right here. Right? Section. So I asked every single one of them, I was like, so where did the side piece sit, you know? <laughs> did they say wow. anything? And every guy was like, come on, man. <laughs> like, what do you, you got to do this, man? Yeah, he's like, come on, Edit man. this shit out. Yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Oh, yeah, and yeah, anyone yeah. that acted like that, I was like, so yeah. we're the side. Yeah. Why are you so upset, man? I was watching this thing. 
on TV where they, this woman was talking about, you know, Kristen. Oh, look, there it is. Good job. <laughs> oh, this is that. That's hilarious. <laughs> It, did it make it in the cut? No. no, no not no, a chance. No, no, no. Not a chance. Oh, that's Cart-talk. hilarious. Wow. I didn't even know they had card talk. Card talk. Good, that's good. actually a good idea. Let's go yeah. find some players. When was this? Oh, years ago. Oh, 2017. We rolled, yeah, we're all at the Rams camp. <laughs> <laughs> did you know that your coach was Georgia High School Player of the Year ahead of Calvin Johnson? No. I mean, he looked like he got some juice to him. Are you ready to surprise him? This is a oh, good yeah, idea. Stuff, really good. Stuff, yeah. Think, they didn't do it again. Hmm. I wonder why. I don't know. I, we COVID and all that stuff happened. Oh, oh got it. Then it was just like. Someone should pitch it to him now. Yeah, they should do it again with you. Do you want to keep watching? Have I heard of no. Uh, of course not, Nick. So, um, but. No, but. Wow. <laughs> I, I mean, bro, <laughs> I get enough for you, you know? Fuck off. You could learn about the players. You don't know shit about football. I don't. I don't. I don't. Um, you know what's surprising about I'm not didn't mean to no I'm no, no saying, go, go. surprising about football players they're they they are not as big as you would think well the linemen are right but if yeah yeah, but yeah, the, but, the, yeah but even those yeah, linemen yeah. are like it's not like yeah. there's only like like of the 50 man roster yeah. there's gonna be like six or seven yeah, yeah, of them yeah. who are like you know Monsters. six three yeah, yeah we're like up, God, you know damn, and a lot yeah. of times it's the quarterback oh. yeah of the really good teams the quarterback's gonna be like six five Dude. lanky but the skill pounds. positions and the corners oh, and yeah. linebacker you're like oh that's a normal I'm looking dude I remember when I I tore my ACL back in the day I was like 26 I mm-hmm. tore my ACL, and then uh, I was getting training at uh, this place in Inglewood, and like Shaq was in there. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That's <laughs> the kind of place it was. <laughs> yeah, big foot, small dick. Yeah. <laughs> and this guy, and then like, but other players and these football players, I was like, damn, you a little dude. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, they're like a running back. Yeah. Is a little. Yeah, they're not jacked. Yeah. Not people j- think they're like because the, that movie. Just their stature. Any, any given thing. Sunday, people are like, isn't everybody like that? It's like, no, that's Hollywood, man. Mm-hmm. They're normal looking well, dudes. Also, they just fun. made them look big, probably. Yeah. I mean, fucking. Movies. I don't know how big Jimmy Fox is, but he, they made he's him. not big. But right. they made yeah. But LL Cool J. But I'm saying, but you no. get near some basketball players, and it's a whole different thing. That's yeah. the most surprising. You see a basketball, player, you're like, oh, he's seven. Yeah, they're so foot. big. Yeah, it's <laughs> unbelievable. And they look terrible in clothes always. I love it. Oh, I love so. the fucking f- the thing that has become the when they the walk fashion? to the game, dude, bro. They all look so. Terrible, like clowns. Like they look, they look rich, awful. <laughs> but 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 like uh, the clothes. Sometimes the clothes are awesome. They look shitty. It's in too them. much fabric. They're too much. Yeah, it's one hundred percent. They look. Their body is all fucked up. Like they wear a They're coat. Like, it looks like that. It looks like the drapes. It's just dude, like it's this terrible. long fucking. Dude, you're like four inches away from being a basketball. Yeah, you're size. not and that, sure. And that honestly, counts, dude. Those four no. inches are the worst. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like six, yeah, if you're six, seven, eight. First of all, you know, that's getting horny, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> this shit is lit. But <laughs> but do you want to look? What is that one like, called? Look at this. Look at him Bur- walking. Look at him walking. Burning. <laughs> He looks terrible. He's known for being wild dude, as fuck. But, but he looks so bad. He's Mario. so tall, dude. It's no, a no, no, no. That guy's Westbrook. like your height. Russell no, Westbrook, no, I saw four. him. Six three. No, six, I four. saw him. He's, he's six three. I no, saw he's not no, 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 dude. You might be thinking Kevin Durant. Yeah, he's tall. No, That's I Russell saw him at the airport. He's not tall. He's six Bro? three. He's six three, bud. I'm an inch taller than him. No. That's all bullshit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, I, I don't look like that when I wear that fucking red you, overalls. It, oh, you do. It's all him. Yeah. He must be super thin then. But Ben Simmons wears wild shit too. Yeah. Anyway, dude. At least he balls. Oh, oh that's a Halloween. That's a Halloween outfit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He looks cool. No, no Kevin Durant dude, always so... looks crazy because he's just lanky. Oh, what? Is that a... He was, this is jo- he was Halloween? Kevin this Durant is... always looked depressed. I'm be a crossing guard. Yeah. Why not? Whoa! When, wow. you have, when you have that kind of money, yeah, I I understand, and I'm just fucking being silly, you know. Dress how you want for real, but like, uh, you can't drive look, any cool cars. They either. look awful. Yeah, it's you have to get to them custom. Feet, you know, like, yeah, get a Ferrari, then they got like blow out the back seat and t- so they can fit their big asses in it. They yeah, can't they drive anything lot. dope. They did, no, they no, they, dude. Ferrari makes cars for these guys. I'm, they have to custom order. I know, but I know, but yeah. they make. Them, they can. They all, you all see them. You're yeah, it's a beast. They do. I don't yeah. know. Wow. Yeah, yeah they have to redo the entire yeah, like, chassis. Crazy. Everything. It's Ferrari amazing. does it. Yeah. Ferrari fixes it. I feel like I don't know if you can order from Ferrari. Ferrari. There's a they take to a place because Ferraris atta- they don't give a fuck. They're like we we made what we made. Do you like? Yeah. <laughs> you know. <laughs> You drive. Yeah, they're, not, they're not doing that no. shit. Cut to Chris's grandma with meatballs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
That's how she was. <laughs> yeah, would you rather be seven foot, like outrageously tall, or sh- short, like five one? Tall. You, you can't be five one, bro. You can't be five one. Yeah, you just, you no, simply no, no, cannot not five, be five not, one. No, but nobody like nobody not, fucks. That's with not good. Would you? Okay. It's no. Okay. It's would you rather be four nine? Okay. Or seven five. Seven five. Seven five. Seven five. You, you die so early. We're gonna fly on. You can't fly. You just run there. <laughs> You get there way quicker than a regular guy who runs. Oh my god! Imagine your stride. You're, you're, no okay. one can keep up with you. You're just you're yeah. just walking in the mall. Yeah, Everybody's yeah, yeah, like, yeah. "Hey!" Yeah. Oh man, Crystal would be so mad. I do that anyway. You know what I mean? They're like, "Come on!" Like, <laughs> <laughs> your kid is just like, yeah, yeah. Eh, you know. Yeah. What about? Uh, would you rather be five seven or seven yeah, two? Seven two is a nightmare, bro. It's a nightmare. But five, your house, seven, though, yeah, five, seven, your clothes, seven. family pictures, they're all back up. You got to back up. I don't, <laughs> I don't far even away. Like, I don't even like when Rachel wears heels. Yeah. Because she likes to do this. Like, I'll be barefoot. She puts yeah, her heels yeah. on, and she goes like, I'm taller than you. Well, you're tall, bro. <laughs> what are you, right. uh, six I'm 6'3". Six three. You know what you're I mean? You're 6'3". Yeah. So when Rachel oh, wow. does that, she wears these heels, on, and she likes, six, she likes four. to. 6'4". She's always like, I don't, you know, I don't like short guys. That's you know? funny, though. You know what I mean? That's funny, yeah. What would she? She's six and feet, I, right? Then I sweep her legs. She's five eleven. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You're you way feet. I mean? You're way feet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> she, she, is she five eleven? What is she? She's six foot. Damn. Wow. Yeah, that's why I'm trying to put a basketball baby in her. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be that little league dad. I'm gonna have uh, a whistle for no reason. I. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go, go. <laughs> I had I, I dated a girl that was six foot. Um. And the the yeah, I did a girl that was six foot once. It's it's it, and they put on heels. It's fucking. You're like, I mean, I'm tall. I'm six two. But it's a nightmare. But they're hot yeah. enough though. Yeah, 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 no, yeah. But, oh but, no, I love tall tall women. I love yeah. like they, they, that's for dancing and everything. It's just I used to date a chick who was five five one. It was a nightmare. Yeah. It, well, yeah. for like yeah, I get it. Outside of yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, Hell yeah, yeah. you talking about other stuff. You talking about horizontal mom? You can go like this when they. <laughs> 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 you know <what> I mean? <laughs> Erica Freak. When they little, chin nose. Um, <laughs> chin nose on top. <laughs> you pro- oh man, what this guy's a, a unicorn in the Asian world, mm. right? Oh, Godzilla. And only one tall girl was like 5'7". I thought she was super tall, but everyone else was like 5'3", five, 5'2". Five, so really? Yeah. Super small, yeah. The 5'7 girl got You're bullied. You're saying that you've ever been with? <laughs> it always felt weird being with the 5'... What's that? You're saying all the women you've been with are... are oh, my, yeah. My exes were five, small, five, yeah. Three, yeah, yeah. But the 5'7", I felt I felt like she was so tall, it didn't feel... I, oh, really? I didn't feel as manly, yeah. What are you, 6'1"? Six, <laughs> Chris, no what dare you. you. Are you taller than six, me? 6'5"? Five? No, I'm 6'2", at least. Oh, Hold on a second. One, one inch off. <laughs> Really? Hey, man, every you. inch matters only, with me. Only in dick it matters. No, chin, chin <laughs> has to be 6'3". You style your hair different. You're, my, you're what I said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, so wait, hold on. Um, well, that's why Asians usually do that. <laughs> to, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's 6'2". Yeah. Uh, so six, if, two, so all right, we're all around the same If height, you're yeah. into Asian girls, though, it's just, that's, your, that's all you get. The, the majority Short, are really small. Sure. Yeah. yeah. You know, Which tall. I like. I prefer shorter girls. You I do, yeah. Yeah. What? I mean, if you're into Asian girls, that's what you get. That's what you get. Yeah. Hey guys, get off your phones because we have phones, to do some ads. We got to do Dude, some ads. Dude, you got to get ready, man. This Saturday, the action pack UFC 287 fight card finishes. That's what I'm saying. The longtime rivals, right? Alex Pereira and who else? Alex Pereira. Pereira. Izzy Adesanya yeah. will face off for the middleweight title. Alex beat him last time, so we'll see what's happening this time. Ooh, Is he think? still a favorite? I, yes. I pick Izzy via decision, but I write Izzy's nuts. Let's go. Go down for your shot to win big with DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of the UFC. New customers can bet just $5 on a pre-fight money line and get $150 in bonus bets Whoa. if your fighter wins. Plus, all customers can get closer to the octagon excitement with DraftKings same-game fight parlays. Ooh. Combine multiple UFC 287 bets into one for a shot at even bigger payout. Download the app now and use code GOLDEN. Let me give you some picks. Right. Uh, so Izzy, uh, uh, you could do a parlay with Izzy. Gilbert Burns is the biggest favorite on the card. Adrian mm. Yanez is a slight favorite. I like him via decision. Kevin Holland, big favorite. That uh, Rosa Jr., I think, gets it done. Toughest test of his career. Uh, mm. Kelvin Gaslam, you like that pick, Nick? You bet. I do. I do. Kevin Ga- Gaslam over Chris Curtis. There's some uh, good parlays there, so there you go. Uh, Download the app now and use code GOLDEN. 
New customers can bet just $5 on a pre-fight money line and get $150 in bonus bets if their fighter wins. This Saturday at DraftKings Sportsbook with code GOLDEN. Minimum age and eligibility restrictions apply. See show notes for details. Yeah, no, there's um, not that many tall ones, I don't think. Uh, yeah, and then I... I that's it. I don't know. What else? You know? I don't know. What are you talking about? Height? Oh, I went to SeaWorld. <laughs> I went to SeaWorld. What? Over the weekend. Where were you? Uh, know, was that Orlando? Uh, San Diego. Oh, you were in San Diego. I drove Diego. down to San Diego, took the kiddos, because you can do like the the animal experience. It it was kind of sad. It's kind of sad. sad. But all the other animals are cool, like the penguins dope, the dolphins are cool. But then you see the big ass killer the big whales. Ones. And you're like, yeah. God dog. And I was like, hey, man, because we had this uh, guide with us. I'm like, the the big one, his fin's like this, man. Does that mean he's sad? He's like, that documentary, Blackfish, man, that's what they tell you. He's like, it's You didn't even mention that. That's hilarious. <laughs> no, I did. That's oh. how you know it's no, true. No, I did. I was, like, oh. I was like, hey, because on that documentary, he's like, that documentary, they're trying to make us look bad. It's basically a sunburn. And that's why it's not sticking up. I was like, oh, that doesn't make sense at all. But I'll just a not say burn. anything. Yeah, so when I watched that, the that's bullshit. We, they style it. We didn't put the gel in it. So <laughs> I watched the documentary when we got back from there. And I was like, God, that place is fucked up, I, man. I don't fucked know, man. I, yeah, I don't. It sucks. It's it, I, We went to something like that. I don't remember where we were. We were on the road. But we took Calvin. And it's just like kind of sad. I mean, of course, we paid for it. So we gave them money. And then I kind of fucking felt bad afterwards. But. The penguins are lit. They don't give a fuck. They're in a frozen area and they're chilling. My son was the bought my little one. He's three. He just grabbed that fucking penguin. I was like, oh, this really? poor penguin. I don't bro. think they're allowed in there. Yeah, I don't know. I what that? threw him over. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you just gonna throw your kid in the gorilla sanctuary? <laughs> no, get out of there. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you learn to fight. Yeah, the whole thing's sad though. When you see the big animals, like, I, yeah. I, I saw a picture you had your kids next to the dolphin thing. Yeah. And then I, I commented, I was like, your fish tank is getting ridiculous. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. That's <laughs> but seriously, get rid of all those fish. So, yeah. uh, so. <laughs> they could do a documentary about yeah, you. Yeah, 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 they yeah. are. <laughs> all their fins are like this. <laughs> all right, who's this what guy you that we've seen before? <laughs> seen before? Yeah. My dudes, Brendan, Chris, Big Griffey I've Griff. met him. Nick, my boy Chin, mm. had a question to bake up for you guys. I was wondering, how do you guys start your day? How do you guys end your day? Was oh. it a shower in the morning or a shower at night? I have to shower in the morning because otherwise I feel like I don't wake up all day and yeah, I don't fucking too. like it. So let me know what you guys think. Brendan, I'll see you here in SD. Like always, Chris, you killed it in SD when you were here. Thanks, buddy. Griffin, I wore the sweater for you. Gang, <laughs> baby. <laughs> <laughs> That's a cool. That is a cool hoodie, man. Fuck off. Is that you, yellow? No, it's fucking tan, dude. Oh, it should be yellow. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. No, it's tan, and it's like a guy like this wants tan. No, you know? switch it to yellow. Okay, uh, I have yellow on there. If you want to go to Crystal Lee, I can't even go peruse. You know what I mean? But like, <laughs> I have beach towels for fuck's sake. Summer's coming. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> what a weirdo. Swim, hey, swim, you swim start short. your day how, Eric? You wake up at what time? <laughs> let's just let's just power through this. <laughs> Let's just power through his crazy ass. <laughs> power through it. Just I, power through I get up at nine. I get up at nine a.m. every day, no matter what. Oh, you wow. sleep in. Yeah. Damn, and you're a comic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It just, it just, it is what it is. It's just, I have the I, in the phone, iPhone has a great like sleep thing, so it's like yeah. it tells me when I should go to bed, and it, you know, so I just automatically now I just wake up at nine a.m. So okay, you go to bed at three a.m. Wake up at nine a.m. It depends on if God. I have shows. Three would be late for you because, dude, bro. No, do, doesn't do matter. You ever do like I'll be in. This is the thing, though, dude. If you do a set at midnight and so say get home by what one thirty? Yeah, but no, nah, but you're dude, not doing not, a set at midnight. We're guy. not doing those anymore. But hold on, if you do two shows on a Saturday, yeah, and you did two shows on a Friday, Sunday you wake up. Dude, I'm I want to die. Done. Yeah, done. I done. mean, I'm maybe when I was 33, okay? But bro, that shit fucks Fuck me you. up now. Yeah. I'm exhausted. You too? Yeah. Exhausted. Yeah. Well, I still wake up at 9 a.m. Yeah, it dude. Matter, I mean, right? Sunday, I'm fucked. You wake bro. up at what? Three, four in the afternoon? I wake up at like 10 30. Really? Yeah. Now do you take a shower at night or in the morning? No, nah, I wake up, I take a shower in the morning. See, you yeah. guys shower every day? <laughs> Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah, who wouldn't? You believe that? <laughs> <laughs> hey, good, right, dude. What are you talking good about? Guy. No, every day. You are too big to yeah. not shower yeah, daily. Yeah, yeah, big guys got to shower daily. Yeah, yeah dude, you're oh, lying. God. I can tell. <laughs> dude, here, I, I, I shower. Nick doesn't shower either every day. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, when, the YMC, when the YMCA is open, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Nick's like, I'll find one. <laughs> yeah, Nick showers every day. He drives to it. Um, <laughs> dude, I, I shower every day. There is a, a rare instant. Sorry. 
There is a rare <laughs> instance that I shower at night before. Um, it, actually, you know what? I never purposely shower the night before. Sometimes I shower the night before because I want to wash my hair or something like that. And then I wake up the next day and I'm like, I kind of feel like I showered recently so I can start the day now. Isn't that isn't that fucking interesting? No. <laughs> um, <laughs> you're a chick. So, my, my, listen, Rachel is all about don't get in this bed without showering. What do you mean? If, if I, because like. That's crazy, You bro. You go all day. You're a big dude. Yeah, dude. You Sweating go all day. Oh. Yeah, I'm tits old. You know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Backhand you? No, we're big guys. No, we're big guys. We're both big guys. Don't bring me we're in. We're sweaty. You don't even shower every no, day. No, man, that titty sweat. Filthy animal. The titty sweat. Yeah, so it's like uh, you know, I get like back of the neck, you know, here Ew. and stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah, dude. Yeah, you know what I mean? You should just you sleep in the shower. Yeah. Honestly, um, <laughs> fuck oh man, you laughing at my thing or yeah, that, you're stupid. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, what you say? I said you should just sleep in the shower. Yeah. <laughs> so she wants. She's like, I don't. So some. She'll say to me, Have you showered? Have you showered? You know. Oh God. Now here's the next question, though. Let's mm. say you shower at night. Okay. Okay. And you know, do you sleep in underwear? What do you sleep in? I, underwear. Yeah. I like to. I like to sleep naked, but Calvin's, but Calvin's been coming in the room in the morning, so I'm like, all right, I can't sleep yeah. naked anymore. No. Yeah. So ew, your sheets are just horrible. Yeah, bro. Um, yeah, I sleeping yeah, naked's weird, bro. They're dope. My sheets are so dope. No, it's just because Kristen has to change them every two. No, and no, half no. Even when hours. the doper, the more I sleep in them, the no, doper they get. No, she changes them. You don't even know. No, no, I'm saying. You get in bed and you're like, are these new sheets? Because she has to. Because she's like, yeah, because there's like a fucking, you know. Shit straight. Yeah, it's, it's like the, what the, the what is that, Shroud of Christ? You know what I mean? <laughs> you try to turn in? Yeah, Chris, it's just. It's just you sleep naked? Like, <laughs> you sleep naked, naked no, too? No, I wear, Okay, this is my question. So, yeah, we're underwear. Now, do you get up? Okay. If you sleep in underwear. Yeah. And you've showered the night before. Yeah. Do you just get up and get dressed? Okay. Yeah. Right. Like, do you change underwear. underwear? I'm saying, do you get put on new oh, no, underwear? Oh, no, I put on morning? new underwear. Why? Yeah. <laughs> you guys are wasting really... water, dude. We're in a drought. I don't think it's that big of a deal if you do wear the same underwear, but I do change it. It's a big deal to Rachel. <laughs> but if I you're mean, clean, I can, I can you've it's done nothing. Rachel. She, I just didn't matter to her, dude. Like, listen, she, she'll she help me pack now when I go on the road because she can't stand how I pack. So I used to pack like, I'd be like, okay. She was like, where's your, I packed my bag. She was like, where, where's your underwear? You know? I was like, it's right there. I said, four days, four undies. Yeah, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And then the ones I have on are the extra. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. So now when she packs just like morning, night, morning, yeah. night. Oh, no. You know? That's what I do. No, no. Her no. underwear are all over the place. Because she just changes them just for, just willy-nilly. You know what I mean? <laughs> So, well, yeah, they're also this big. Yeah, right. right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's your what, what? You know what I mean? It's like it's unfair. You pack fucking seventy-five pairs, and I got three. Yeah. So I wait. have a lot of cloth. Yeah, in yeah, my yeah bag exactly, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so wait, so you, so, so what about shoes? You bring one, two pair? Uh, it depends. And then what about you? You, what do you, what do you bring? You fucking three. Okay, that's okay. Three pairs. That's okay. Yeah, yeah. I bring three pairs. But but because. I'll bring maybe three. Yeah. I'll bring like uh, 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 ones that I know I'm going to wear in the airport. And then if I want to just yeah. wear comfy. Yeah, exactly. And then I have like maybe a not a cool Jordan, some yeah. kind of cool pair. Yeah. And then another one that I'll be able to wear kind of with every outfit if yeah. I need to. Me wow. Too. I'm, I'm, I'll mix it up. Gay. It up. <laughs> and it's all good though. Then I'm gay too. Yep. We suck. What time would you, you, you know what? You you wake up at what time, Dick? Uh, six. Six, yeah. Whoa. Chin? Seven thirty seven forty five. And then when do you go to bed? 11, 10 ish. I, I want try. you in bed early. I want you in bed earlier. Uh, so, what about you? About midnight. I want you in bed earlier, guys. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm up at five, and I, no matter what time I go to bed. So, go like when we did a, uh, the set at the ice house the other night, mm -hmm. I probably went to bed at one, up at five. Oh, My man. body will be up at five. That's every what I'm saying. Time. It just Doesn't happens matter. like that. For me, it's nine. And if I start setting my thing for 8 a.m., which I start to, I kind of want to do, it's just, because once I'm up, I'm up. Then I get up, I have my coffee, and then it's just like I'm up, you know? <sighs> five, son. And now Ra Rachel, though, like, because she works, she'll get up at, like, she has to get up. She likes working really early. So, like, I'll wake up and she's gone, you know? And she you mean she likes if she has a job that she has to go to really early? Or, she decided or she does with her job. Stuff. She was like, I want to get there earlier. Also, the benefit you know? to waking up early when you have kids is the only time that you're just, I can do whatever the fuck yeah, I want. Don't get me wrong. Waking up early is, is awesome. I think it's great. I'm just... Not doing it. <laughs> it's just too. I'm too tired, bro. <laughs> I think it's great. You wake up, you see that, dude. I woke up at seven today, and I was like, man, I'm. I think I'm up. I might get up, and then I was like, oh, yeah. dude, 
Who am I kidding? <laughs> no, but here's I'll the, wait here as long as it takes to go to sleep more. No, but and here's the thing. If you're my, okay, if you do get up at seven, right? Mm-hmm. And you have that feeling of like, mm-hmm. oh wow, yeah, kinda yeah, up. Yeah. You should get up. I understand. Yeah. Because if you don't, uh huh, and then you, you and then uh-huh. you'll wake up and say at like eight thirty, yeah. you'll be like, oh. Yep. So tired. <laughs> I don't wake so up. So tired. Then. My body's not in charge of me, I'm in charge of me, dude. And my body's not telling me to fucking wake up then, dude. Oh yeah, body? <laughs> You're in bed like Yeah 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 <laughs> Go to sleep <laughs> What do you got Nick Wow that looks cool That porch <clears throat> With the trees and shit What's up going now okay, wait, up at five. Right, This is in the morning So you were talking about how You have to take the trash out But where the level of your home is Oh it's yeah It's on the main floor yeah. But the trash is That's down right. below And I get exactly what you're saying And it's funny When we first moved into this house My wife she she thought I would go outside. There you go. And go around to take the trash. There out. you go. That's hilarious. Yeah, That's hilarious. It is. Let me show what you a nice here. deck. Yeah, bro. yeah it's fucking. Let me show the you lights are great. This guy's lit. He's a CEO. That has to be five a.m. Yeah, this for is... sure. Oh, oh, this guy's. Oh wow. <laughs> oh, Yo, <Jesus>. engineering. <clears throat> Boy, if you miss though. Oh, That's my bites. favorite guy that we've ever got. That, that is so gangster. I gotta is. do that. Take the string. It's like, like 5 a.m. See you later. Listen, when you're good, you're good. Yeah, yeah. and you are. He's doing it. Best. Hey, well, you, you know. Yeah, I do. <laughs> oh, he ran I, out. I like, no, I like the he way. He ran that, out. He ran out. That's my favorite, though. So, wait, that <laughs> is so good. I got to do that. Um, His deck. How about you can make my deck? Also, how, 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 also how much is that the neighbor's fucking trash can? That you <laughs> it's just like, I'm not filling mine up. Fuck it. Um, uh, I think that's a great. Oh, that's awesome, dude! Awesome. So, <laughs> I'm upset already with how you're reacting about this. <laughs> yeah. But let's see how it goes. I guess it's. I don't know. Yeah, it's, it's just. It's you like think good it's for fine him or whatever. Yeah, yeah all right. Fine. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cool. So you know what? I'm upset. Lazy husbands, you know, right, do dude. lazy shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's crafty. It's ingenious. This guy. That's what we you do. know what? I'm just pissed, and I'm. And it's okay, but I think it's great. This oh guy's wow! Great. And oh, this guy's got a whole setup for Collins. What the fuck? What's up, everyone at Golden Hour? Brendan, Chris, Eric, Nick, Chin, love y'all. Uh, I had a quick debate club for you. What do you think about this UFC WWE merger, um, Brendan? I was especially curious what you think. Is this like a retirement plan for old UFC mm. fighters? Um, is this a good thing? How do you see this shaking out? Thanks. Love y'all. Chris, you want to take this one first? Yeah, I'll take it. So here's the deal. I think it's crazy because WWE is wrestling and UFC is, not, you know, it's punching and shit. Um, and and chokeholds. Dude, I think that, that it'll be, I think it'll be a good thing for both projects. You know? Um, I don't like it. Yeah, me neither. Because it's gonna because bl- <laughs> it's gonna blur the lines of like what's real and what's not. But bro, have you UFC. seen? The you UFC's see. already That's gonna. The, the UFC's already yeah. got a lot of issues with like, you know, is this a fixed fight or is this like a right? Or is this the is this the right fight for this person? And so now to know that they're attached to something that is completely fake, that but it's entertainment. I know, but it's everything they're both but entertainment. Listen, the lines are getting blurred. Yeah. Everything. That's the thing, though. If it's around long enough and popular long enough, it becomes the same thing. Bro, everything becomes the same thing. Not sports. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it does. Because because you take... Remember when Instagram was just Insta pictures? Then it became fucking videos. videos. Then so did Twitter. So yeah. did fucking... It's everything that's successful becomes the same thing. Bro, WWE is basic... UFC, you see the guys at UFC now? They're like, I'm going to go in. I'm going to kill these motherfuckers. It's, like, it's the same thing. The promo, they're running well, the, the promo. The promo's the same, but at the end of the day, the result is of, it's a real competition. Of course, yes. So you know why Vince that. McMahon was going to buy the UFC? And then he goes, you know what? He turned it down because he goes, I can't control who's going to be a star. I would never invest my money in that because the bi- they would have Conor McGregor go undefeated. If they were allowed yeah, to yeah, dictate yeah, who, yeah, yeah. they'd have him go on to feed for the mm-hmm. rest of the history. I guess that's good for so Vince McMahon, yeah. he can dictate you want Patty, that. You want you'd want Patty. You'd want him to be the, like your, the, you the know, face the of the UFC. Warrior, you'd want you know Ronda I mean? never to lose, so they can't yeah. dictate that. Well, she's a real in the sport. WWE now, killing it. Yeah, you know? yeah. yeah, yeah. It's just it's just the no, li- he, the but, lines get blurry. But no. the the biggest thing of all this is is the it came out the UFC got evaluated at twelve billion dollars. They sold for four billion. So they're worth what three times more now, but the fighter pay stays exactly the same. Why? That's the issue because they don't have to do anything. 
they didn't they don't have to do anything. So if I'm a fighter, I'm negotiating. I'm like, hey, you guys worth what fucking eight million dollars more than when last time I negotiated this deal? Give me more money. Like what leg do they have to stand on? Well, because another fighter will come in and take their place, right? I mean, yep, is that, that basically yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, you're right. Fuck, look at you. <laughs> well, it's about the fighting. It's not about like it is. Let me just say this. The the, the 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 issue is is that the fighting community hasn't uh, gone with the times. So these like high school college basketball players, they're getting on Instagram. They're sure they they're they're making their videos like like Zion Williams being paid came into the league with a million followers. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So like Jake Paul has been trying to tell y'all dumb motherfuckers, here's how you can make a lot of money. Promote yourself. Yeah. Fuck Dana White and all these people that don't pay. You, you, it's all about what you do. Yep. It's the same thing with like podcasting and stuff yeah. like that. Self promote yourself where you are the attraction, yep. yeah. and then you can uh, d determine how much money you make. Hot because these people Eric. aren't. They're not <clears throat> personalities. No one cares about these like idiot fighters. Right, right, Correct. Right, right, but then right. also when, as a, <laughs> you know what I mean? in regards to like well, a lot of them. In, 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 a lot of them, yeah. But also in regards to like fighter rights and them getting equal pay and all that shit, whatever they're looking for, this pushes the ball the opposite direction. Because anyone knows that the WWE Vince McMahon runs e even more strict, more like a fucking, you know, straight dictator. He does not put up with shit. He owns all your rights. Yeah. All your rights. Like The Rock, you know, The Rock on movies uses Dwayne Johnson. Mm -hmm. If he uses The Rock, they have to pay the WWE. He owns all your name, all your likeness. Yeah. Well, I mean, because, you know, he's an asshole. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's how you get to have that much money. Yeah. Correct. You know exactly. what I mean? You, you, you're not like you've done some fucking ruthless business shit. Yeah. You but know? to Eric's point, it, I, mean, I do think. That's thick boy runs. You I, know yeah. <laughs> dictator here. It does, run, it, it is, it does blur the lines a little bit because already, like, in America, not so much. We know the difference somewhat. But, like, my dad doesn't. Yeah. Like, is The Undertaker fighting Brock Lesnar? Is, where's oh, wow. Dana? You're like, Jesus Christ, dude. Right. But then uh, in internationally, it's even way more blurred. They definitely don't know. But here's the thing. Oh, you take Ronda Rousey, for instance. You know, when someone comes from a legit, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. she was a fighter. Yeah. Her face was fucking ruined. Yeah, one Brock of the best Lesnar to ever do too, it. Right? Okay? So now when she goes into this... WWE, even though we know yeah. that it's entertainment, she still brings something to Same it energy. because of what she did before. Yeah. If they're just together, then there's no legit. It's kind of like delegitimizes, if that's a word. Yeah. I mean, dude, uh, you know what the, I mean? At the end of the day, you know that UFC is real and wrestling isn't. I don't know if they're only because you're the same around person. like us in the sport. But if, if if they start crossing over, like you have Connor at the next WrestleMania and he's playing grab ass in that, then jumping back fighting for a title, like it's gonna get weird. Yeah, man. I think I agree with him on this one. I think it's gonna. But I mean, also, are idiots I, but also there, as yeah. a business move, now yes. the UFC and <laughs> W and WWE are worth like twenty billion dollars. Now they can go to a, a Nike or to ESPN or Fox when their deals are up. I'm like, hey, we bring this much of an audience, yeah. loyal audience. Yeah. Give us how much money now? Yeah. Or they just create their own network. Yeah. It's tough. I mean, you know, but they should, uh, you know, they should share. This is the stupidest thing. WD and talks with state gambling regulators to legalize betting on scripted. How the fuck you can bet on it? Well, if I'm friends with Hulk Hogan. Clearly, I don't know wrestling, so it's the only reference I have. But if I'm friends with Hulk Hogan, he's wrestling back in the day. I'm like, hey, bro, who's gonna win? Well, they're gonna have to. There's it. it ha, it'll have to be regulated. It'll have to be just like in the same way that somebody knows who's gonna win the Oscars. You know, like and there's a there's an accounting firm that knows who's gonna win before the Ernest Oscars and come. Young. And Ernest people and still Young. people still bet on it. So they, you know, you know, it has to be. You have to know. It's all about integrity, man. It's like betting on the Oscars. Yeah, yeah. it's like betting on. Yeah, yeah. yeah. John Wick's gonna win in the end. I just think it is more credence to like it's blurring the lines because if you're allowed to bet on scripted yeah, results, totally. it's under the same umbrella. Like, yeah, that's why you can't bet on. Or you, that's why you can't fix sports because it's so you get in such federal trouble from regulators. But if it's now legal to script it and still bet, yeah. that scares me. Yeah, Do we start betting on movies. I'm, I'm fucking. <laughs> He's terrified. It's insane. I'm terrified. I mean, Nick said he's You're scared. I'm up. beyond that. Yeah. I can't. I can't sleep. And I, I wake up. I go. Oh, I go, oh fuck. The betting. Well, the betting. Yeah, yeah. Let's take a break, guys. Cause I'm gonna be powering up when I'm in Atlanta uh, next Thursday, Friday, Saturday with some factor. America's, America's number one yes. ready to eat meal kit. Get you nutritious, chef prepared meals. 
delivered straight to your door, leaving you time and energy to tackle everything on your to-do list. You know what the best part about this? What? <laughs> what, man? <laughs> it's too exciting. Calorie smart meals start around 550 calories or less. I love that. Yep. If Portion too- control is the most important thing about yes. losing weight, y'all. Factor has delicious flavor-packed meals to help you live to the fullest. You can choose from keto, mm. vegan, mm. veggie, veggie if you want to look weird, calorie smart, and protein <laughs> plus options on the menu each freaking week. <laughs> want to cut back on takeout? Cool. Get Factor instead. Not only is Factor cheaper than takeout, but meals are ready faster than a restaurant delivery. It's just two minutes. Just heat it up. Ready to go. Put the time and money you save towards planning activities like watching this podcast. All right? Factor is delicious. Head to factormeals.com slash golden50. Use the code golden50 to get 50% off your first box. That's code golden50 at factormeals.com slash golden50 to get 50% off your first box. Let's get back to this stupid program. Same book. It's not good. (sighs) All right. All it's right, good go. for the UFC. It's bad for, I think, general fans. Well, be, yeah, I don't know. Okay. Here's a question, Nick. This is deep into it. These guys were going to space out. <laughs> Do we know how much the like top five WWE superstars make compared to the top five UFC? I don't, but I know. Like, Are you a wrestling fan? Uh, no, um, but oh. like, I don't know. I I kind of am aware of what's going on. I know like Brock gets over seven figures for one match. Oh, and time. WWE does. Yeah, so mm. I, but their contracts, I have no idea. Gotcha. They're all independent contractors. Okay. Would Eric and Chris, since you guys don't really follow MMA that much, would you guess that the UFC is worth more or the WWE is worth more? WWE. It's been around for so long. What, what, what about you, Chris? Eric? I would guess um, WWE. Yeah, I would think the WWE is worth more. Too. How UFC crazy is, is this? UFC is worth more. Really? Yeah. Three billion more, 12 to 9. Huh. Huh. Broke bridges, right? What? Broke bitches. <laughs> Nine bill. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine. I dude. wonder why I wonder why that is. Is it because it's probably more international or something? Or I don't know. Maybe room, is it the probably. events? Maybe room what for it, growth what it, what too. It is. What it, what it is. Yeah. Well know. maybe the T V deals are different now or what is it? I, I, that's WWE surprising. T V deals are big boys. Because they provide so much content every week. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, that's surprising. Yeah, to it, is, it was surprising yeah. to I think all of us. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I know what it is because it's fake. <laughs> what else you got? Well, yeah, but all right. Hey, what's up, fellas? My name's Hayden nice from shirt. Dallas. Nice uh, shirt. I've called in before, but I have a different question for y'all today. Well, um, we would hope. Top three Denzel movies. Last night I showed my girlfriend Training Day. Have to. She had never seen it, which is crazy, but uh, She's she rushing. loved it. It's a great movie. For me, top three are going to go Man of Fire, Training Day, and then Book of Eli. But you also have Flight, where he acts his ass off, and Equalizer. Um okay. But yeah, what is y'all's top three? I gotta watch Flight. No, no, no. Oh, Flight's good. This, this guy already missed the best. Malcolm one. X. That's a great one. That's a great movie. Uh, but American Gangster. That's nah, I hated that movie. Ooh, I love that. Oh, movie. I love that movie. Too. So boring to me. Hey, you know what? who's you know whose uncle that is? Who? David Lucas. Who? Well, his uncle? What is? Uh, Frank from the, Lucas. The, the, what? The, Frank Lucas. Frank is Lucas the, is David Lucas's uncle. Frank what? Lucas, the gangster. Yes. Yeah. Wow. The gangster. Yeah. Whoa. The gangster talking about in the movie, right? That makes so much sense. All right, dude. I just want now to make I'm sure not Denzel Washington. No, no, no. It's Frank Lucas. I woke up to David. Your, your uncle is Denzel Washington? <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, David Lucas, that's Denzel his uncle. Washington's son is a great actor, too. Yep. Really good. Dude, Dude Denzel Black Washington's been so many good movies. I don't know how the fuck you rank it. I mean, yeah. Philadelphia I is fire, X. too. Philadelphia is fire. Have you ever seen Malcolm X? No. <laughs> racist. <laughs> no, it's not racist. I would see it. <laughs> <laughs> um, Malcolm X, fantastic. I mean, Philadelphia is fucking amazing, though. Philadelphia is good. Yeah. Um, he's also gay. good in the Pelican Brief. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but yeah, I, it's, I mean that movie. Come on, bro. You know? <laughs> Great movie. What other? I feel like we're missing one. Glory. Have you seen Glory? Yeah, Glory. Yeah, Glory was amazing. Oh my lord, <laughs> lord, lord, lord. Um, I don't. I don't want to hear. Oh my lord, <laughs> lord, 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 lord. And you haven't seen Malcolm X. Um, lord, we come here today and gather around just to. <laughs> Make sure that everyone. Oh my I God! I, I would, oh, remember the oh Titans? Lord, 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 Lord. <laughs> I wouldn't go to this church. Yeah. Oh. Do you remember imagine Chris in a in a fucking in a in a in a robe? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh I got to start a church. We're and freaking just a eight, eight fat black women are behind. Oh him yeah, dude. <laughs> 
Dude, we're Fuck for, yeah, we're dude. forgetting a bunch of them because uh, remember I the Titans is fucking. Oh, Inside Man is a I great I can't believe one. this guy said Book of Eli. Honestly. Remember yeah, the Titans is fine. What about sa- Safe House is great. Fences. Equalizer can it, suck my cock. The first I mean, one was fine. good. I like the first one. Five oh, This seconds. guy's been in some gangster movies, dude. Jo- John Q. The Hurricane. Oh, The Hurricane. He got game as fire as fuck, too. That was good, too. That no, was but, good all right, all right, all right, Eric. <laughs> yeah. was, that was a good one. Virtuosity? Keep going. No, that one's <laughs> terrible. <laughs> Virtuosity was <laughs> trash. He, so what became... that? So Malcolm X made him a fucking big deal, right? Oh, Glory made him a big deal. Go up, keep a lot going. Of things made him. A Malcolm movie. X was kind yeah, of yeah, but a, Glory was the one. Ah, uh, Malcolm X, right? No, Glory was like nominated for a bunch of yeah. yeah. That whipping scene was yeah. incredible with the one tear dude. Yeah, dude. Uh, before dude, the CGI kind of the one, I've never seen it. I was just like, oh my lord, <laughs> oh lord, lord. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I just, um, I, just, I can't with you. <laughs> yeah, but dude, I, I mean that that uh, Denzel is the. How, how do you rent? I I don't know. I, I mean, there's so many also I haven't seen. Training gotta, Day number one, though. Yeah? I don't know if I'd say that, bro. Training Day's or Malcolm fine. X. Training Day's good. I don't know if I'd say that either. Training Day's but, good. Yeah. But but like top three Denzel movie? I You know what it is, really? And let's just be honest. I'm going to be one. Yeah, but no, but it won it. the Oscar because he should have won for Hurricane. That's why. No. Denzel Washington should have already won. No. For a lot and of then things. they came. Yeah, they yeah, do yeah. that shit. Yeah, they do. You should have won for Malcolm X. Right, but but the thing is, but there's a lot of diff- there's a lot of reasons why you know that yeah. didn't happen. But there's a lot of times like they, they give somebody a lifetime achievement award. Like Pacino should never should have won for Scent of a Woman. That was ridiculous. Yeah, he should have won for he fucking won over Dog Denzel. Day Afternoon yeah. or he whatever. Won, the yeah. Fuck. yeah, he should he won over Denzel that, and that was like nah, Pacino just no like, way. Oh, 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 you know? <laughs> you know, and the Oscar goes, dude. I could act blind. Good. <laughs> oh, shit. What What's blind that? person do you know that does that? Yeah. <laughs> a new I don't know blind any person. fucking blind. Yeah. <laughs> Expand your circle, man. No. Um, <laughs> but I think the thing about Denzel is that he's great. He's greater than the movies he's ever he's, of course, he's done. Yeah, yeah. So that's so, why yeah. when you're thinking about like yeah. what's the best one, it's yeah. like you go, I don't know if I overall if I remember a movie I really yeah. like. You would put like that, but he because he's so believable. Like it's like whatever character he's playing, he comes on the screen and you go, okay, I'm yeah, in. I'm in. Yeah, yeah. I'm in. Yeah. Out oh, of oh, time. You're, oh, you're a doctor in this one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm in with this one. Oh, you're a criminal. I'm with you. Whatever yep. it is, I'm with him. Yep. Mm. Oh, you're gonna play Anne Frank. Okay. Done. Yep. I believe you. He's just in the attic. He's yeah, so yeah. tall. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. With a little dress on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Ha, ha, ha. I can't wait. Try to hide from these Nazis. Yeah. Is that Worst that? Denzel ever. <laughs> I know. So I can't bad. do Denzel. Um. Hey guys, it's Jillian coming to you from Virginia. Um, I've got a debate club for you. So I'm a boy mom, and my oldest son is eight, and he's in all the sports. Um, soccer, baseball, basketball and swimming and no it's getting football, to that huh? age where it's getting competitive and like there's all stars and all that stuff and i really thought i'd be chill i thought i'd be like whatever you know oh. i just want you to be there and have oh, fun no way. it turns out i'm real competitive <laughs> and I'm, i mean so is he but like i find myself saying things my dad would have said to me and same with his like his dad we were, we're both like we're just we're too serious it's yeah. hard not to be it yeah. doesn't matter. You're yeah. monsters. So I guess, what are your thoughts? Do you just let your kid play and you're just giving them that this is just for fun vibes or are you that walk it off oh, parent? What a good my question. Son his Great question. Like, she looks so much off. like... And I was like, oh my God, my dad and I hate when my dad did that. She looks so much I like show. my ex-wife. Doing is crazy. what you doing? I say, always she looks like Mac's wife. You don't, you don't think she exists? <laughs> Mac's wife? No. She, she looks like Mac's wife. did not look like that. Your best wife was like a cabbage patch doll <laughs> that, you, Why? that you kept in the <laughs> – and he was like, babe? Uh, in regards to your question, it, de- it depends if you know what the fuck you're talking about. You know those parents like, come on. It's like, D- did you play yeah. football? Did you ever play soccer? Do you know yeah. what the fuck you're talking about? Because yeah. if you know what you're talking about, you gotta go ahead and jump on in. You know, I, I, mean, used to, I used to coach. You know, oh, yeah. what'd you coach? Coached a lot of things: basketball, oh, volleyball. And the thing is, is like, if, if she's like a sports mom, you know, it's like moms were the most difficult to deal with mm. when they didn't understand the sport because you, you know, moms. Was, this was all right. <laughs> Sweetheart, sweetheart, sweetheart. <laughs> no, because they would be like, Sweetie. we'd have this team yeah. meeting, and it would be like, you know, a moms, moms would say shit like, they'd be like, uh, coach. 
um, uh, it was seventy five dollars for the team shoe. Why isn't Johnny playing? You oh, know, right, right. it's that kind of thing. Yeah. Right, right, and I'd be like, right. well, that's not actually how we decide yeah, 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 who yeah. plays. Oh, because Johnny sucks. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah. You can't. They don't care about that. No she shoes ain't helping. Playing. She'd be like, uh, you had that other kid playing. He don't even know who his dad is. You know, it's that kind of shit. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be like, well, I mean, imagine if that's how you decided. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Timmy can't even read. Yeah, get in there. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm saying it's like you know, I I don't know. There is something about. Um, Cause listen, I, my my mom never came to my games. Mm-hmm. I never invited her because it was like she was a single mom. So yeah. I never working. It wasn't too. a thing. But there is something about like when people would get on. I remember like, those dads being in the stands yelling at you know, yeah. come on. They used to get on me. Come on, Eric. You know, I'd be wow. like, fuck y'all, hustle, like, Eric. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, getting on me. Can fucking talk to your whole kid, bitch. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. know. But I do remember. <laughs> I do remember I was kid. like I was playing, <laughs> I, I was a basketball player, you know. Mm-hmm. So I was like I was down in the post, and and I, I had this little guy on me, and all the dads were over there, and then I, I, this guy uh, he's he's gonna he's looking at me, and I said like this, "Give me the ball on this fool," <laughs> you know. That's hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> and all the dads, dude, I'll never forget. Yeah. All the dads were like, "That's right, Eric," you know. <laughs> That's the attitude we need, dude. And I was like, it did something for me. Though. Yeah. I loved that recognition yeah, yeah. from those parents ah, like yeah. that. You know what I mean? So it was like, so I get like, wow. I think that as a player, as an athlete, I remember being an athlete. I was, guys, back in the day. There is something that you get, you know. I, I, I So I understand. I like that. And that, when that was a coach, I would be like that. It brings out my competitive nature. Yeah, so it, I think that, But I try not to overstep. Like, I'm not going to be like, why aren't we, you know, throwing the out route more? I don't get too yeah, technical. Yeah. No, you don't want to be But I'll, I'll bring him over. Like, my son was in a passing league, and they were running. Not nonstop running. They're down like twenty one to zero running at halftime. Like coach, I talk to you. I'm, I'm looking. It says it's a, it's a passing league. You keep oh, wow. running. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're one of those parents. Well, I'm, just curi- I'm just curious. I'm just curious because they're seven, right? Ugh. And we need to learn to pass. Ugh. You stupid fuck, right? Ugh. I hate. I I, I would have hated. And then jujitsu, I don't overstay. I, I let the whatever professor do his thing, and then after class, I'm like, come here. You don't know what the fuck he's talking about, and then I'll show. Him. Oh really? That's what I do. Yeah, well, that, that's cool. Or if that's I see it, cool, but or, I or if I see a kid doing something wrong and the the like professor's all the way on the other side of the mat, I'm like, dude, you gotta I'll, like move. I'm like, try this. Uh, oh, you're oh my god! I, that's but they told me I, they told me to do that. <laughs> okay, wow. but it would be stuck. You're like a coach, and then like you know, the the ex UFC fighters standing on the side, you know, giving you that like. <laughs> I yeah. Would hate that. yeah, but it, I would come to you be like, "Hey, I need you to not come to practice." <laughs> yeah, we got, it. we got it for we got it for you. But yeah, thank you. Yeah, but he is a he, or was it was a professional, so it's it like, doesn't matter. You're undermining. Yeah, I understand. You're undermining. <clears throat> you know, if, understand. You're, if you're coaching kid basketball, if you're coaching Michael Jordan's yeah. son no, at basketball, you're right. You're right. you don't want Jordan sitting in the sidelines, just you know, looking like this. You know, I don't but if know Jordan why. had a good I, tip, I, I wouldn't have done it that <laughs> but way. If, <laughs> but if MJ had a good tip, you're gonna listen. That's what my whole point. Why it's undermining? Get the fuck out of here. I get it. Come to the game. Just but, be a dad. but also be a better coach. Just be a dad. But be a better coach. Just be a dad. Nope. Can't. Just be a dad. Never. We gonna I don't win. know how I feel no, about no. that. This is the thing. I, I what was really crazy. Just coming from the other perspective, it's mm-hmm. like when they're when they're yeah. like fighting in the stands. That's another thing. Well, that's oh, I've never, that's never. Crazy. When never. dads are just like, you, you know, what, what's going with my son? Yeah, my son need to be playing. You know? That's <laughs> crazy. My, put my son in, coach. You know, <laughs> that's crazy. I like that man. I don't. I don't knew disagree. I was going to be a comic because the things I would say. What? You know, to the dads? Yeah, just everybody. I, 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 just, everybody be laughing. Oh, really? I was putting on a show when I was coaching. Nice. Kids you had a, you had a microphone? <laughs> yeah. <I'd be> like, <laughs> it's good to be here, y'all. It's good to be here. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I mean, it is one of those things. Like, I, Look, it, it's it's a crazy thing. Because I, I can remember also having like a team meeting and, you know, the parent, just parents come and they'd be like, yeah, coach, what are we, what are we going to do about our, our – what are we going to do about his grades this year, you know? And I remember saying to this mom, I said, you know, you have six teachers, a guidance counselor, yeah. you. Right, you. So how about from three to five, yeah. I work on layups and free throws. <laughs> right. And the rest of the time, you take care of all that stuff. How about we do that? She's they like, would well, say that to you about the grades? Oh, yeah. Hey, that's what, because. Well, what are you going to do? It, that's the thing. Tutor them little bitches. <laughs> no, they wanted like, us to be like, I'd be like, no. Nah. It's like, I never liked when, I remember there was this time to get this, the. Uh, this, this, we were. It was a summer league game, and the kid didn't show up. And then the next game, two games later, the kid showed up with his parents. And the parents were like, well, yeah, I had to punish him because he, uh, oh, you yeah, know. Yeah. And I was like, oh, cool, cool, cool. I didn't play him the whole game. Yeah, of course, right. I didn't play him. And then the parents were like, hey, what happened? I was like, oh, yeah, you punished him 
So now I have to punish him because he missed a game. Right, yeah. right, right. You know what I mean? You can't like, just jump like, back you in. You can't just like – I hate when parents used this sport to – Punish the kid because you're punishing everybody. Kids rely. I remember this God, mom. This guy still got issues. Yeah, with I know. It, I can't stand it because it's, it's like it's bad, parent, it's bad old. parenting. Yeah, no, uh. this guy. He's, he came in second place. He wanted to win the championship. No. He's pissed off. It is. Oh, no, no, I'll never forget the league. It's a league. We're starting the league. <laughs> All right, start the league. All right, it's it's a league for opener. Uh, that's you know, a sitcom. One player. of our best players, you know, he didn't get the best grades that his mom wanted. It. We're about to start playing. What grade are we talking there? High school. Okay, two, two second grade. <laughs> <laughs> mom comes storming on the court, and you know, he, uh, during the layup lines, he he off the team. He got bad grades, you know, and it's, she goes, it's not going to happen on my watch. And in my mind, I'm like, apparently you haven't been watching shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. dude. Okay, <laughs> so you mean to tell me on report card day is when you found out your cunt, your kid is dumb? <laughs> Yo, bitch, you know what you need to be doing? You need to be working on your kid's grades from the first day of the semester. Dude, I'm right now, I assume now, I'm, the school's I'm <laughs> as scared as Nick with the WWE <laughs> I just, merger with the just, fucking. It just pissed me off because it's like. And I assume you're coaching Malibu the way you're talking? Or? No. You, if you have to, if you, it, listen, training your kid, training kids to learn responsibility is not taking them off the team. Because here's my thing. It fucks the other team. It, it fucks everybody else. Yeah. You're learning responsibility. Because my thing is this. I, I, I remember saying, okay, you're going to take him off the team. Has he still got a cell phone? Is he still watching TV? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He still got God a car. Damn, you've thought about this. If, so if much. he still, <laughs> is he still? You know, thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Does he still get to go out? Because you know what? This is what happens. This guy's fucking thought about. They this don't want to take every like day. like. If, let's say your kid has a car and they're driving to school, right? Yeah. And then he gets in trouble. You take the car away. You know who has to take him to school now? You, y'all, lazy ass parents. Yeah. Fucking guys got. And you don't want to do that. So I'm saying, like, if you if you have a kid. <laughs> Step up. You know what you, 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 know what you got? No, you got the fucking thing. Hey, hey, with asshole. The, with the yarn connected. He's like, hey, you do this and that. <laughs> no, Eric's going to have a yeah. kid and the kid's going to walk in. He's going to be fucking 16. Eric, he's going to walk in late. Eric's going to have the light on just, yeah. just on him. Like, yeah, he'll, have a, he'll have a suit on. Keep going. <laughs> and Eric would say, I would take the car. Yeah, then yeah. I'll have to drive you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Oh, oh, don't, you, don't, yeah. you don't even. You don't know, that man. I'm, I'm, already, I'm already ready to be. I, I'm petty. Oh, I know. I'm, when I'm having kids, they're not going to tell me like when, when they if they say, "Why well, don't want to do this?" I'm oh, so we not doing stuff we don't want to do? Okay, cool. I ain't taking you jiu-jitsu. Then I'm gonna go turn the lights off and turn all the phones and shit off. They're gonna be like, "Dad, what's going on?" I'm gonna be like, "Oh, I don't want to pay the bill." <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so we we not doing stuff that we don't want to do. Let's keep going. Yeah, what else? So we're going to be Love living it. in darkness. <laughs> That's the kind of dad I'm going to be. Wow, dude. Okay? Trust me, I'm petty as a motherfucker. Yeah. Because well. you have to learn. I remember it's, it's important. <laughs> I, these kinds of things are important. Yeah, Learning Chris. lessons are important. Dude. I'm, I'm not going to have a spoiled ass kid. You yeah. see, I, this dude's Instagram, Calvin is a little spoiled ass little. <laughs> yeah, he is. <laughs> well, he got, you know, but yeah, but bro. Living in his little mansion room in his side room. <laughs> yeah. Nah, bro, I'm, I'm Calvin good, Calvin got man. two rooms. <laughs> yeah. He's on email. He's got two rooms. <laughs> I, I gotta tell him. I got. I, we we talk though. I tell him what's up, dude. He's gonna be okay, man. He's not do, gonna be. Do you see what Ashton Kutcher did? He said we're, we're we've decided. We've told the kids mm -hmm. when yeah. they turn sixteen, we're giving away all our money. They're gonna I get hate nothing. that. No, they said when they no. die, they're not leaving. Them. I hate that. You know what? You know what? I disagree. I don't hate it, but I don't like the application of it. How about this? How about it's like your money's in a trust. Yeah. You have to get a degree in college. Yeah, yeah all right, sure. You have yeah. to like you have this amount of money Fair yourself. Enough. Yeah. If you make it, they say say if thresholds. You make, if you make a million dollars yourself, yeah. that's a lot of money. All this money is yours. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, have some incentive. Yeah. Win, a, win an Oscar, I mean, and it's yours. Okay, that's pretty pretty hard to do. But I mean, like, if you're gonna do giving your money away and saying, "Yo, kid." Life's hard. Figure it that out. That can't it's be the way to do it. Terrible. Yeah, I'm not saying that's what Ashley Kutcher's doing, but like no, I'm with you. That's that, what that's I'm doing. That's exactly what it's what's doing. terrible about it is like this though. It's like don't like have me grow up rich. Like, oh, take yeah, it yeah, away. Yeah, you know, yeah, you yeah, grow yeah, up yeah. rich and you go okay. Now you yeah, go like yeah. you. You know, hey, I did, what did I learn? <laughs> we, yeah, we that's what's right, right, yeah. right, right, right. It's like releasing killer whales at SeaWorld back in the ocean. Like you'll figure it out. They're fucked. Right, right, right. Super fun. Keep bringing back the fish, but yeah, 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 yeah. SeaWorld. You love fish. Yeah, I don't know, man. I, 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 yeah. I heard Bill Gates was only going to leave. I mean, I don't know. He's going to leave his kids like ten million dollars or something. Fine, okay. Oh, that's a lot. No, 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 no. no. I'm saying that's what are they going to do? Saying that's good, but like leaving them nothing is crazy. Yeah, yeah, that is crazy. That's crazy. The only now after Calvin, I got another baby on the way. 
this is why I'm making money at this point. Right, 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 right. You do it for them. Yeah. yeah. And Ashton Kutcher, close I mean, to yeah, a billion. Yeah, stuff now. Close I to still, a billion. I'm still dripped out. You know, I'm going to buy, make sure I look flossy, right? But whatever. But, like, I'm going to leave most of it to my son. <laughs> but I want to go, you know, daddy wants to take a shopping spree. Daddy got to do it. But, dude, yeah, I still keep a lot. For, I'm not getting rid of it when I die. Dude, you're dressing me in a nice thing in my casket. Yeah. That's going to cost some money, but the rest goes to the others. <laughs> it's going to no, cost no, some money. She's just going to throw you in the ocean. Oh, <laughs> dude, yeah. <laughs> just me. Like, yeah, you just float. In a fire-ass <laughs> outfit. Yeah. <laughs> no, just go get some shoes from the closet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not getting anything new Nothing for new. this motherfucker. Man, Eric went on a rant. Yeah, that was crazy, Eric. <laughs> it's just, it's just, you're um, a crazy guy. How many years did you coach? He's all one year. <laughs> no, no, a lot, a lot. One season. Yeah, many years. A lot of championships. I guess jersey's too big, right? Yeah. It's also not no, a thing, right? No, no, no. Right? His head is too small. Mm. Oh, that's what it is. That's what it is. Like, angle, that's a normal size angle. jersey, but his head it's is a ho- like, Hockey's tough. Like like a somebody with voodoo, you know what I mean? Yeah, There's Beetlejuice. Voodoo, like that Beetlejuice. <laughs> Dandruff. <laughs> what do you got, Nick? Hey, guys. Bryce from Fort Wayne, Indiana. Uh, I just want to send in a feel-good story. This is NHL player Patrick Maroon after a post-game interview. Uh, what everybody else thought was just another goal that he scored. He actually was the first one that he scored with his son watching it live in the NHL game. And uh, the broadcast did a great job of getting everything, and it's really beautiful. So uh, check it out. So nice P.S. Kid. I came to Brendan and Brian's show when they came to Fort Wayne. Uh, great shows, but don't worry, Chris. I wore my No Dent shirt to both of them. Hell yeah, yeah dude. Yeah, he did. So, uh, oh, wait. Buzz, buzz. Uh, sore. Woo, 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 woo. Go Detroit Red Wings, baby. News came in and supported, and... You know, Dry Saddle came in and, you know, great play, and just, we just got it through. And, you know, I, I always tell myself I have to get to the net, and, you know, good things happen. So, you know, it felt good tonight, especially in my hometown. Yeah, what, the goal was uh, great, but I wonder what you think of this reaction uh, by your son and family. It's pretty cool. Um, oh, it's pretty, pretty emotional. Oh. But oh. pretty cool, but. Uh-huh. I don't get to see him as much, Ed. Uh-huh. It's pretty special. Yeah, and uh-huh. he thinks that of you as well. Hey, Patrick, thanks uh-huh. a lot. That's Christmas is on the way. More time with Anthony. Absolutely. Okay, thank okay. you. I, I just have a question. Oh, Hopefully you lose God, in the playoffs Eric, and you go good. spend time just, with your son. I, just, he, I don't know. Getting, I have a question. Uh-oh. You just start talking about the coaching. Uh-oh. No, no, no. I'm just saying, like, uh, you're a millionaire, I would assume. Why aren't you spending time with your kid? Because they play so many fucking games. Hockey's like baseball. They're on the road nonstop. But this kid looked like his kid was like of, of an bring age. Him. Bring him. Yeah. Bring I don't know. I'm just saying, why is this the On first the time? On the road? Take him. saying, why is that the first time? I'm just curious. Yeah. Why well, is what the first time? Why is that the first time his kid has seen him live? That's the first time he's seen him live, he said? Yeah. They see him score. Score a goal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, so yeah, he's yeah, just yeah, a yeah, trash yeah. player. <laughs> or he's like a defense guy or who knows. Eric keeps it real, but he's a dick. <laughs> yeah. Make no mistake. Okay, Eric, now, Eric, now bad I'm guy. T- I totally get it now. So he's like, yeah. Yeah, he's happy he yeah, made man. the goal. He's crying because he made the goal his son, and his son man. got to see him. Oh, because yeah. his son's been there many times. He probably didn't score. And he has his Yeah. His son is just in the stands. I suck as a player. My son finally saw me score. It's weird. He's like, I don't get to see him. He stands like, is that your dad? <laughs> when he scored, everyone went, finally. Right. No, I, I, I think that's really sweet. Yeah, like, no, cool. no, what? But I was just curious. That's I know, sweet I thing, know, Eric I know. ruined it. His yeah, Eric ruined the feel good yeah. moment. Of course, great submission, my man. Yeah, no, that is sweet. I like that kind of shit. That's that's very sweet. I love that shit. Fuck yeah, dude. That makes me happy. I, it makes me happy, dude. Me too. When Calvin Tell runs Eric out on stage it. after at the end of the show, every now and then he does that. You know what this needs? What it needs like buttons so you can pick the one you want. Because it sucks when, when you goes like, ding 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 ding. Oh! Yeah, you want this. Every time. Right? Then that stupid one comes on. That one's good. This Don't one. do it's that like, one. Fuck yourself. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, guys. That fucks up the joke. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. Hey, look at me. Go fuck yourself when Jesus that one comes Christ. on. So yeah. you want to. Oops. Oh, yeah. yeah. Brendan interrupts. You want to go. Oh Every time. Okay. Okay. Not ding, 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 ding. I'll work on fixing so Brandon interrupts. You don't want, <laughs> you don't want that. It's over. <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll Eric came and fired up. Eric had Take one week off. off. Okay. <laughs> Eric had one week off working TV. Now he's treating us different. Isn't yeah, he? shout out to George Lopez. I did the Lopez show. That's why I wasn't he, he here. This guys. at ChrisLeah.com. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you still found a way to fucking yeah, promote? Wow. Jesus Christ. <laughs> crew. Uh, Danny from Indianapolis uh, got a new segment for you guys uh, ruining holidays so what? Mother's Day 2007 ruining I holiday. ran my grandmother over uh, he ran broke over. quite a few of her ribs <laughs> her pelvic bone in two places and snapped her wrist 
Oh my god. And I god. pulled her out from underneath the car. <laughs> um, no, she didn't die. She's still still around, busting my balls every chance she gets. And, yeah. Uh, introducing me to anyone new that she meets as the one who ran her over. <laughs> wow. So, yeah. Oh, grandma Green got run over by a him. vehicular manslaughter. Whatever you got. Whoa. Yeah, Bang, buzz, buzz, sore, woo, woo. That would ruin your fucking life. Uh, that's, what holiday was it? Mother's Chris. Day. Oh, on Mother's Did you say that? Day, bro. I thought they said Christmas. No, they said Mother's Day. Well, anytime it's so bad. Yeah, know? yeah, dude. I don't care if it's yeah. just Tuesday. Right, if it's, right, if right, it's right. Easter, who gives a shit, man? You run your grandmother over on whatever day. If it's, it's a like Sunday. A thing. That day's now ruined. Yeah. Never run your grandmother over. Yeah. Well, let's say to. that. Dude, but also, get out the way, old bitch. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> What's she doing behind the car? <laughs> Why are you in the way? <laughs> but, all, but, but when you're... Yeah, you... Uh, but they're old and shit, and you're like, if they're over, you got to look a little bit more carefully. Also, you, get a better car that has the, like, you know, beep, 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 beep. He looks like a mean? truck guy, though. Might be one of those big 1500 Silverados. Or boom, mm -hmm. But everything's got reverse cams mm -hmm. and stuff like Could've that. Could have been now. a horse. <laughs> have you ever had holidays ruined? That was really his question. Yeah. yeah. That was his example. Um, I mean, not that badly. Not yeah. not really, no. Nothing trumps that. No, yeah, no. I, no. Not, I never really had a, a ruined Attempted holiday. murder, no, never. My I mean, dad pushed a Christmas tree over at a family reunion for Christmas. On, on, on purpose? Oh, yeah, he's pissed. Well, that And it was like, it was one of those big trees. Like, that you counts. see at the fucking like, yeah, I mean, Times that's Square. That's tough to follow, but that's ruining all Oh, my dad was like, oh, no. Why? Who was he having a fight Why? with? Santa. M no. You didn't bring what we wanted. Yeah, my son asked for it. Oh, you know that his dad was broke, so he was like blaming Santa. <laughs> yeah. It's fucking ridiculous. You didn't bring my son fish? No fish? <laughs> 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 fucking. It was last uh, it was, But when my parents were together. <laughs> It was when my parents were together, and yeah. I, they were going through a divorce. Some, he got in a fight with my mom. Oh. I'll never forget. I was young. I was like four. I just remember this huge Christmas tree going. Rrr. You ever ask him later, like, why you fucked the, the tree I, he, up? That just sparked my memory, and he's coming to town on Friday. I'm like, hey, why the fuck did yeah, you push that you tree that? over? He's going to go like this. wasn't me. I don't remember it. Yeah. yeah. Take mom in the other room and fight. Why are you going to push the Take tree? Take mom in the other room, bring the tree, push it down right there in yeah. that room. Dude, yeah. hit her in private. Am I right? Well, no, I don't know. No, I don't think so. No. Do you guys have a thing uh, like... You you don't fight in front of your kids. Yeah, try not hard. to. Is it, is it kind of you know? It's, it's impossible because it's just you're not. It, it takes a lot to like. It's really. Can really we do hard. this later? It's, I'm just not that guy. You're not that guy. It's tough. It I, takes it's experience. Do you right? ever undermine your the other person? That I really try not to do. Yeah, that, I do it all the time. Like no. my my girl will say something, and I if it's off on like food or whatever, my son, I'm like, no, nah, no, nah, come here. Oh no, you can't oh, do that. Can't don't do oh that. no, no, no. Trust me, it's the biggest fights we get in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I'm working on it, dude. I Are know. You? No, I'm working on it. It's, it's. You know that's good. equivalent to pushing the Christmas tree. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. not good. Yeah. Yeah. Oof. Yeah. Let's talk about Nick's twin sister for a second. <laughs> Is it a twin? <laughs> no, it's not my twin. Oh. She's she's uh, yeah, four years like older. Yeah, you send that group chat. Yeah. yeah, I ran into Nick's sister at the uh, at the airport. She was like, oh, yeah. she does sister. colonics. She's an ass expert. Oh, what? what? What's that? You really? You shouldn't have told, shouldn't have told yeah. us that. <laughs> Um, she was really sweet. Nick getting fired up, <laughs> like inside, just bubbling. <laughs> He's all. You gonna uh, tell us his sister uh, works with asses and not think on a on this kind of podcast? I thought it was common knowledge. <laughs> I didn't even hear about that. His sister yeah. does colonics. I want one. What, what, uh, like a colonoscopy shit? Yeah. No, Do, no, like, no, no, no. A, a ass cleaning. No, she you know, sucks. Isn't that what a colonoscopy they is? Suck it no, out. No, a colonoscopy is uh, when they're checking for oh, right, prostate right. checking for okay, stuff. Doctor, there we are. Doctors do colonoscopies. Yeah. Uh, any, anybody can open up their own colonic shop. But yeah, she's yeah. killing it in Minneapolis. I, I felt like a little bit of shade there by Nick, right? Mm -hmm. she's, he's like, she, she's not a doctor. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Anyone can like shove the, a tube in your ass and make money. And cut to her being like, yeah, anybody can press buttons on a computer. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, your sister is uh, not ugly, Nick. Nah, she was sweet. She was pretty, yeah. And you, were Good you guys job. close growing up? Uh, yeah, yeah. We're, we're super cool. That's awesome. Huh. Was there a moment when you saw this picture and you were like, okay, uh, Chris? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, at nah, she was like, at least it's at the airport. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> you guys didn't go together, did you? <laughs> <laughs> On your flight. <laughs> You guys uh, took a picture at security? <laughs> it was right afterwards, because that's when she came up to me. I was like, no, get the fuck out of here. Yeah, What a coincidence. And she, yeah. Do they look alike at all in person? Yeah, you, they're definitely brother-sister, yeah. 
It's 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 pretty. It's always. I think it's always weird to see like meet somebody's sibling after you know them for a while. You're like, oh fucking, that's so weird. Yeah. I mean, it's a little different when it's brother sister, but when it's like brother brother, same sex or whatever, sister sister. You're like, oh, that's so fucking. It's so weird, bro. It's so weird to see people that look alike. When you meet somebody's family and they look just like like my family, and like they're all Dalias. It's fucking like weird, similar. bro. And they, but, and they know they know like her. The sister knows you because you work with Nick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like when I came to your son's birthday party, yeah, yeah. Uh, I was like playing with your son, and yeah. they were saying like your. Wife Wife was like, oh no, uh, uh, that's Daddy's coworker. Yeah, yeah, Don't yeah. Don't say coworker. I know it's. I know. Well, it, it, yeah. it, so it, it, I mean, you know, you say it different to it. Yeah, no, I get it. I get it. Mm -hmm. he's, it's not like he's gonna be like, oh, which podcast? You know what I mean? <laughs> no, Calvin <laughs> might. Calvin might. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Calvin that's just true. Be, just looking, <laughs> which one is it? Calvin would just be like this. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> is, that, is that Golden Hour <laughs> <Yeah>. or? <laughs> What else you got, Nick? That, that's it. He sings the that's thing. That's it. That's it. Let's go get some colonoscopy. That one, right? Oh, that's our move colonics. Yeah. So if you're in Minneapolis. Minneapolis. Oh, you, I, can see, I can see Calvin. You should have Calvin do it. Be like, all right, buzz, buzz. Yeah, 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 you yeah, know, yeah. all that shit. That'd be funny to hear him do it. Jam on it. Yeah. We need jam on it merch. People love jam on it. Yeah, they jam do. on it. That's a good one. Uh, jam on it, man. I was laughing so That hard. was so funny, dude. God, that was fucking funny. That's hey, it. That's every time it. people poop. All right, Atlanta, it. see this Thursday, Friday, or next Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Atlanta, Georgia, Europe. So I'll see you guys soon. Man, I got a ton of dates. Go to chrisley.com. Also, Nashville. I didn't mention that one. I'm coming. Just go to chrisley.com. Code don't push me for pre sale. All right, this comes out Thursday, so it's to be maybe a little pre sale. But yeah, chrisley.com. I'm going everywhere. All right, Springfield, Missouri, April 13th through the 16th. I'm coming. Louisville Comedy Club, 20th through the 22nd. And the Mothership in Austin. Come check me out, 28th to the 30th. I think I think David Lucas is going to uh, be there with me. Oh, cool. Dope. Yeah. Love yeah. him. And, yeah, I'm still doing my UFC combat buddies, watching old UFCs every day chronologically. And uh, the Friday this comes out, uh, Mike Davis, you have ten and two UFC fighters going to be joining me. He's a big uh, kicks. He's a big streamer himself. So, all right, guys, love you. See ya.